My name is Katie Moore. I am a visual artist from Foxford in County Mayo. And my first memory of the Linen Hall would be when I was a teenager. Um, I must have just signed up to get the invitations in the post for exhibition openings. It would have been around 18 years ago. I think I was probably 16. And there was an opening for an exhibition and I saw that Alice Maher was going to be doing it. And I was so excited, so nervous. <laughs> so I asked my mom to drive me to Castle Bar to go to the opening and was so excited to be in the same room as her. Of course, I couldn't even look at her. <laughs> I was too, too starstruck. But um, yeah, I think that was probably my first exhibition here. And then a standout moment would be, I did a portfolio course in Westport and we were brought to an exhibition here. And I remember I was so blown away. It was on domestic violence and I can't remember the artist or the exhibition name, um, but it was just everyday objects and they were so moving. So that really opened my eyes to that and how you could use everyday objects. I had never even thought about it before. Um, and since then, really, one of my favorite artists would be Dara Salcedo, and she uses everyday objects in a really kind of moving way. So yeah, that was probably the start of me thinking conceptually, um, all down to the little hole. <laughs> and then um, a great, of course, for me, I was doing an application form for a new work award. It was the Arts and Disability Connect New Work Award. And I had to put down a place where I'd have an exhibition. So I contacted the Linen Hall and Marie, of course, Marie Farrell, got in contact with me and was so supportive and kind and got me the letter almost straight away because I was probably delayed. <laughs> I, I was probably doing it last minute. And she gave me the letter of support. And then luckily I ended up getting the award. So yeah, it was lovely. I got to have my first solo show here in 2018. It was entitled Entropy. And um, it was a great kind of moment for me, um, I guess because I'd been coming here for so long to exhibition openings and um, just exhibitions in general. So yeah, it was great. I loved that I got to experience that and it was a great success um, for me as an artist, I suppose. Um, also, now that I'm here with Brian, <laughs> um, you know, during COVID times, it's, it's great that the Linen Hall are being so supportive to artists and wanting to have a residency like this, which is great. And who knows, maybe it'll become an annual thing, which would be amazing for the arts in Mayo.